Hi beauties, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me, welcome back. Okay, so today I thought I'd do a video uh, with you guys and do it on um, hair treatment, uh, treatments and masks and things like that, and the ones that I use and um, just tell you a little bit about them and what I think of them and everything. So I have several of them here. There's two here I do not have that I do really like. Um, as a hair mask and everything and when I get to those um, I'll insert a picture in between so you can kind of see what the item looks like all right so I probably one of the big things I get asked a lot on my channel or just in general is like some of the products that I use in my hair you know um, I have natural curly thick hair um, and you know it can get pretty crazy at times because the natural curls can just go whatever way they want it to um my hair can frizz <laughs> you know i just there there's a lot of maintenance to uh the not only the curls but the thickness of my hair and stuff too so it can be a challenge a lot of times and a lot of the treatments that like i use um have worked really good for me in the way my hair ends up looking a lot of times like maybe nice and shiny or just more manageable um, you know I definitely 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 need to get my hair colored it has been and this is no joke it probably has been about a year since I've colored my hair probably about a year and in some ways it's good because I gave my, my hair a break. I think you need to give your hair a break sometimes, even though I know it stinks, like I, my grays are popping up and stuff in, in certain areas and stuff, you know. But I think, I think your hair just sometimes needs that break. I mean, overdoing your hair sometimes can just play havoc. I, I love coloring my hair, um, but it can play havoc after a while if if you are constantly you know so I think sometimes it's good to take that break you know just let your hair breathe take a break um, you know take care of it with some treatments and just different things and go from there now most of y'all know if you watch my channel and have watched my channel for quite some time I don't shampoo every single day I probably shampoo 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 the heck <laughs> shampoo yeah shampoo my hair twice a week maybe sometimes I'll push three times mostly it's two times a week I will shampoo my hair in between the times of that if I want to revamp or refresh whatever my hair um, I will do a hair mask in between or even use to me like sometimes I feel like it's a hair mask in itself I'll use just regular conditioner that I, that I might have that I'm using and because I always leave my conditioner on while I'm doing all my other stuff I shampoo my hair leave the conditioner on for like three minutes or so like do my stuff whatever and rinse it off so some of these products here I have um, it's a little variety and mixture of all kinds of different things here so hmm I think I'll go ahead and get started in with uh, some hair mist spray things that I like to put in my hair. Um, I usually put a hair spray mist treatment in my hair after I get out of the shower. Like um, after I get out of the shower, my hair is all wet and everything. And um, I'll take the towel and kind of just pat it a little bit and everything. I don't leave a towel up over on my head unless like I wouldn't mind getting one of the microfiber towels. I hear those are better for your hair because I've what I understand like just use just using a regular towel and leaving it on top of your head can um, increase the frizziness that you get and everything and um, but if you can find one of the microfiber kind of towels which I wouldn't mind getting um, is so much better from what I don't, from what I understand um, so I might look into doing that actually and if I do of course I will do a review on it because I'm kind of curious myself on, on it so all right so some of my hair spray I did 
I don't even know when the videos are going to be up, but I did do a review on the soy protein and caffeine volume. Um, these oil mists from Proget Proganics. I have this one for volume. Um, I have this one that's called the Quench that's supposed to help for hydration. Um, of course, you all heard me billions and billions of times talking about my B5 um, from OGX. Love this stuff. So those products there are my sprays. I'll spray my hair after I get out of the shower at some point and just work it all in through and then later I put in maybe my curl cream, my, my curl balm or just balm or just any of those kind of things, gels, mousses, whatever, but then in afterwards. Um, if I'm not using one of my sprays here, um, then I will use, and I love this stuff too, just as much as I love my B5, I love this from L'Oreal. And it's the Extraordinary Oil. Um, this is for dry to coarse hair. Um, and it's a leave-in treatment. This stuff is pretty amazing too. So these are my main favorites right here. So if I'm not using this and or one of the other two sprays, as soon as I get out of the shower and my hair is wet, I will dispense this. It comes out like a nice oil serum kind of a consistency and I will put it in through my hair. Usually what I'll do with something like this is when I'm working it in my hair, I'll take sections like certain areas and like just, you know, like take my fingers and glide in through this way and kind of just do it all in through um, my hair. I'll do like, I'll do a, a pump and a half for one side and then the other side because I do have a lot of hair. Uh, so of course it depends on how much hair you have. That's that or I'll pick my days where I like to use the um, Pantene Expert Age Defy this stuff here and it's like a, a serum it's supposed to help for hair growth or it kind of helps uh, stimulate like it helps the hair follicles like you'll feel you'll feel the circulation working on your scalp and you really do need a good scalp treatment definitely there is one from Jane Carter I do like the company Jane Carter I don't have the product here and it's a scalp scalp treatment from Jane Carter that I think is pretty good it has a minty scent and it has done me no wrong it was actually a pretty good item that I used as well this was an item that was sent to me from the influencer or one of those things I can't quite remember but it was sent to me and then a lot of times um, for the most part like there's times where I have added it when it's when my hair is wet but for the most part when my hair is dry I love this live-in rose jojoba oil that I have um, I do use it for my hair it's this is such a multitasker hair face body whatever um, in your bath, anything, you know, jojoba oil is great for so many, so many, so many things. And it has been great for my hair, for some of my frizziness that I get. With, and I just, I really like this stuff. So a lot of times I will put it on when my hair is more dry um, or set to pretty much dry. And I mostly work it in through the hair. I don't put it on the scalp, but I'll work it in through the hair. So really like that for a treatment. Now, um, we're, I'm going to go ahead and tell you some hair masks that I really like a lot that has worked for me. And two of them I don't have here. One of them comes from the uh, L'Oreal um, line that they have out now. And I'm going to put a picture I think it's total five repair or something like that. I really have liked that one. That one was a really good hair mask. So I'll go ahead and slip a picture in. And then also um, in Sally Beauty Supply, the Proclaim line is they have like a hair mask, an argan oil hair mask.
and you know like between the L'Oreal and that they're like around five dollars and some change or something very inexpensive very affordable hair masks that you could use and I think are really really great that I've used so far haven't used all masks but uh, any from the L'Oreal line I used another one that was for hydrating or something it was like a um, a blue color like a tealy green blue color whatever you want to say it was it was something like that um, so any of those ones from L'Oreal that I, I've tried those two have been really good and then the Proclaim from Sally Beauty Supply I really liked that one um, I don't know there's just something about it that always made my hair feel so silky smooth and just it's it felt wonderful so I also have um, another drugstore one it's really really affordable um, it's like three dollars and some change and it's from the Aussie um, company and there's several different kinds this is the three minute miracle moist hair mask I would look into some of these because like I said three dollars and some change is what they are and they're really good I mean I actually used this today this is all I used today on my hair and my hair is fine you know it's still nice and thick and shiny and just looks looks good you know so this is all I put on my did my in my hair today um, well this along with I think I did use my volume thing I think I used these two things today and then I used a curl curl cream and that's what I usually use I'm not showing the curl creams because I figured these are more like treatments and stuff instead of styling creams and stuff so this one's a really good one you can check out any of the Aussie uh, three minute miracle masks check them out and then these two just are a little more um, on a higher end or pricey well one is pretty pricey we'll get to that one here in a minute this one here is from Carol's daughter and it's the TUI moisturizing hair smoothing I've showed this before in a past video this is the one that I always say that smells like bubble gum and I swear it does it straight up bubble gum that's exactly what it smells like to me straight up bubble gum and so I already love it because I love bubble gum and this is a really wonderful treatment mask for sure I really like it a lot um, this one has coca and shea butters in it and sunflower oil uh, and then pro uh, pro vitamin B5 I'll be having to get a new one here soon because this one's been seeing its day and as you can see I mean I have used the heck out of it I got a little bit left in there but we'll be getting a new one here soon okay and then the last one that I have here I won in a contest um, I was watching a video and the girl was talking about Innovi is that how you say it Innova, Innovi Innovea but it is a miracle mask okay so and she I got samples of the shampoo and conditioner which are really pretty awesome and so I looked up this company which right here it tells you miracle mask so I looked up this company because I was curious and stuff this is a really good mask I'm not saying it's not or I'm not gonna knock it or anything like that this is a really good hair mask and treatment it smells amazing I still got a good bit in there so yay I still got a good bit but yeah it has the professional hair salon smell just got some water on me and this here is a really good treatment too I mean it has really kept my hair soft and manageable and it, and it feels really great I think just the only thing for me and like I said I'm not knocking this I think it's a good product so don't take me you know like that I'm knocking it I think it's a good product but it's fifty dollars for this where is the ounces must be on here 17.6 that's a good bit 
For me, I started to think about the Proclaim mount, hair mask that I was just talking about from Sally Beauty Supply with this. And um, I don't know, I just, I thought, you know what, to me, there's not much of a, a difference in the quality of the way my hair felt. Like Sally Beauty Supply, I really like the place because I sometimes feel like you can find your sweet gems in there sometimes for the hair products. And they're even less expensive in there somewhat. Um, so like I said, I'm not knocking that. I think it's a great product. I just... I think the Proclaim almost does the same kind of a thing there, really, just for a cheaper price. I'm not sure if I'm really seeing the full-on, you know, the shampoo and conditioner of this, though. Mm, I, I did really like it. I liked how it made my hair feel. But, uh, don't know. So anyway, beauties, I hope you found that interesting or helpful. And like I said, I know most people have been asking me, like, certain treatments or products that I put in my hair, shampoo or whatever. And so I thought I'd go ahead and share with you some of the products that I do use. Some of them, some of them are mostly all repurchases. Um, this has been a repurchase, L'Oreal. Um, this has definitely been a repurchase, uh, the Three Minute Miracle Mask. This has been a repurchase for sure, of course, B5. But anyway, beauties, I hope that helped you out. And if you did like the video, please give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate that very much. And also. If you are not subscribed to my channel, I'd love to have you. You can come join me each week. And um, as always, beauties, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. So until the next time, y'all take care. I will see you then. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Love y'all.